Hey guys, it's Captain Ball Arms. Today I got a double chem strike on Stonehaven with the AK-12. My class setup is the AK-12 with silencer and extended mags. My perks are slide of hand stalker, dead silence, scavenger focus. My specialist strike package perks are amplify dead eye off the grid. My bonus perks are ready up, take down, blind eye, ICU, and blast shield. Now I want to talk a little bit about some tips. Now some tips on this map are basically I like to keep them in C or B. It really doesn't matter. I don't really care for them if they have the A flag. Now when they have C, it's really easy to run a route and kill them off the spawn. Also when they have B, there's a good little route you can run and you actually can spawn kill them sometimes if you run it right. But you can do the same thing here too if you run it right. You just gotta learn the spawns. That's one of the biggest tips I can give you. Now I wanted to talk about some gameplays that I have. Now I have a lot of gameplays on Strike Zone because I play Strike Zone 90% of the time on PS3. and the reason that I do that is just because it's the only map that I really enjoy in Domination on PS3. And 6v6 at least. I mean, all these other maps play pretty slow and they also don't ha give you the opportunity to get a fast chem strike. You pretty much see like 5 minute chem strikes as the average on these other maps. Maybe 4 minutes if you got lucky. But you really don't have a chance to get a 2 minute chem strike. There are some maps that you can, like Warhawk or Whiteout, and I play those, I'd say the other 10% of the time and I just have a lot of gameplays on strike zone so I want to know are you guys cool with me posting strike zone like every other day or do you want to see it every day I probably won't post it every day just for the matter of I don't want to post only strike zone but I'll probably be posting it every other day or every two days and hopefully you guys will enjoy that since strike zone is the best map in the game right now now the next thing that I want to talk about is some commentary topics now what do you guys want to hear me talk about I know I can talk about tips I know I can talk about classes, I know I can talk about how to play the game, you know, I mean, domination, I could talk about how I don't like this game, or the things that I don't like about it, like I did yesterday, I can talk about things that I do like about it, just let me know some interesting topics to talk about that might make my commentaries a bit more enjoyable, and if you leave a comment, I will be sure to possibly use that in a future commentary, that topic that you told me to talk about. Now, the next thing that I wanted to talk about is my games now this game was a bit of a long game I believe it turned out to be like 10 minutes long and I basically got my first one and then if you ever get your first one real early you can play really slow for the second one I mean if you get it and under 100 points you should have at least like around five minutes to get a double and it's pretty simple to get a double when you have five minutes because you can just play defensive just go back and forth from one spot or run a route in a certain area near the enemies and you should be able to get it now it took me a while to get my specialist bonus and since I wanted to cut down the game to around seven minutes what I decided to do was just to cut it down on my second streak to right when I got my specialist bonus was I believe 15 kills and then you see the other 10 kills and then I get the uh, chem strike now let me know what you guys think of that I do have to cut down my games I don't want to do a 10 minute commentary and I don't even think you guys would enjoy seeing a 10 minute commentary so that's why I cut it down and hopefully you guys are fine with that I know that some people should be fine with it some people might be a little less fine with it but hopefully in the end it's all right with you and then the next thing that I wanted to talk about is I actually hit 500 subscribers and that's a nice milestone it's halfway to my ultimate goal which was a or which always has been a thousand subscribers and hopefully I can hit that relatively soon it's actually pretty awesome I'm getting a hundred views right now and like a hunt I mean a hundred views right now in under 24 hours on every video and that's all I really could ever ask for at the moment it's uh blew my expectations away on what I could do with this channel and it's really awesome and I owe a huge amount of it to getting an amp and getting my videos posted on there because they have helped me grow so much since I've been in there and got some posts on the channel and I really can't ask for anything else. And I did get this gameplay posted on amp a couple of days ago. It was earlier this week and if you came over and you watched this gameplay, I'm sorry that I reposted it. Or I didn't really repost it. I never posted it in the first place. I just sent it into amp and they actually posted it on the channel and I didn't have a commentary ready for this video so I just decided that I would upload it now and the next thing that I was thinking about talking about is gold guns in this game now 
basically, gold looks pretty good in my opinion. I don't not like it. It's not my favorite gold, but it looks pretty decent. It doesn't look horrible. I think it kind of looks like the gold from Call of Duty 4. If you played Call of Duty 4 and got any good gold, it's pretty similar to that, I think. It's definitely a different gold from Black Ops 2 and um, Black Ops 1. And then, I think MW3 was probably my favorite Call of Duty for gold. I don't even remember. Was there gold camo in Black Ops 2? I really don't remember at the moment, but... I feel like there wasn't, but I don't know. Maybe there was. I might just be having a freaking uh, <laughs> retarded moment here. But to get gold guns in this game, you have to do a bunch of challenges. And I really wish you could just spend squad points on your camos because it would be so much easier. And you wouldn't have to do all this stuff that you have to do. I mean, one of the things I hate that you have to do in this is get 100 lean kills. And that is just a pain. And there actually was gold in Black Ops 2. I just thought of that. There was actually diamond camo. And I was like, if there's not Golden Black Ops 2, I don't know where I've been. But that's basically all I wanted to talk about in this commentary. Hope you guys leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a good day.